we're gonna give you a tour. You can climb down right here. We're not on a rock, we're hanging by cables. Bathroom with the best view. I can't believe we slept in that. Good afternoon guys. We are leaving Apu Lodge and we are going somewhere else very special. <laughs> wow. So this is how you move luggage in Peru. We are going to Sky Lodge Adventure Suites. So they're like these glass capsules that are on the side of a cliff. And we're going to their base camp or office and they're going to teach us how to use equipment because we are going to be climbing up to these capsules. And so it could take about an hour or an hour and a half for most people to get up there. Okay, looks like we just arrived to base camp. Alright, we just got our harnesses on. We're almost ready to go up. And now we need the helmet. Okay, we're all ready to go. We just got the briefing and now we know how to climb a cliff. What we're going to be climbing is called a Via Ferrata and it means Iron Way. So basically they have like these metal bars on cords that you climb up. We'll try to film as much as we can on the way up, but who knows, we're gonna be clinging to a cliff. Let's it might go. be hard, yeah. <laughs> Let's, Let's go. go. All right guys, this is what we're gonna climb. Look, we start right here, all the way up. There are the pods. Wow, 10 minutes in. Look at this. Whew. Oh, side of the cliff. Whew. Made it to the first horizontal part. Okay, we're probably a quarter of the way up. We're about to take this ladder here. Ah, look at this part. Usually it's just straight up, but this is more flat. I, I, this part was kind of difficult. Look at this. No bars here. So we've been climbing for probably 15 to 20 minutes. And mostly it's like this. It's kind of these ladders going up. But every once in a while you get to take a break on one of these ledges and enjoy the view. Most of the way you have these iron bars to hold on to, but some of the way it's actually kind of like rock climbing. Got just this rope right now. Like here, it's just like rock. There's some more up there. Okay, we've gotten to a bridge. Okay. I'm gonna cross this bridge. This bridge. Okay, now. Bridge. Sit on two, oh, wow. three, go. Perfect, that's all. Better than Keswachaka. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Here. We just climbed 400 meters to get to this dome on the side of a cliff. And it was about 900 of those steps up here. That was crazy. We feel so accomplished. We made it. We took a little longer to do it than we thought we would. It looks like it's not as high from down there, but then once you get going, it actually takes a lot longer. I think it probably took us at least an hour and a half. Yeah, so as you can see, it's dark now. We're gonna show you our dinner in this place, and that's gonna be awesome. And then 
We'll show you our pod really quick, but in the morning, the light will be much better. We're gonna wake up for sunrise, and then we'll show you the pod, we'll have breakfast, and then we'll go back down. We now have for our soup, we have a pumpkin soup. For our main dish, we have uh, mashed potato uh, with uh, Gordon blue chicken mm. and a uh, boiled salad. Gourmet meal on the side of a cliff. Salud to making Salud. it to the top, to making it to Sky Lodge. We have some soup for our first dish. It's a uh, pumpkin soup. We're getting like a five course meal here. Our salads just came. All right, for the main course, we have chicken cordon bleu on some mashed potatoes and vegetables. So they get this food from a restaurant and then they heat it up here. Mango, a cashew kind of paste down there. And then apples with some nuts, chocolate sauce, and cookie crumble. All right, guys, we just finished our awesome meal, and now we're going to go and check out our pots. Look at this door. It's like we're going out of a spaceship. Can you All right, so in front of you? we have to connect to this, right? Yeah, please. All right, so you can't leave a room until you're connected. Go. Don't jump too hard. That was a little scary at night. Close the hatch. <laughs> the wind is so strong out there. I thought it was gonna blow off the cliff. Ah, we just got in here. This is crazy. This is definitely the craziest place that either of us have ever stayed. Yeah. It's uh, three beds in a little capsule and a bathroom. We're gonna give you the full tour tomorrow. We're on the side of a cliff right now. If you can hear, the wind is pretty crazy. It's so roaring outside. That would scare a lot of people. But what can you do? This place has been around for over seven years. So hopefully they've got it all figured out. Time to climb into bed. We just climbed into bed. And the wind is insane. It, it makes oh. you a little uneasy. Do you hear that? And you can see the, the little curtains and stuff. You can see them kind of moving. We should stop talking to see if they can hear it. It's just like a constant rumble. Yeah, so anyway, that's a little scary. But this place is amazing it's the best place we've ever stayed this has been a bucket list item for alex for a while uh, and it's definitely lived up to the expectation wanted to come here and when we first here. met you were showing me youtube videos of this place yeah. and here we are in peru doing wow that. so this last part when we wish we could have shown you but it's dark right now so it's dark it's extremely windy and this part when we were going from the restaurant to our pod in the dark with just flashlights hanging on the side of a cliff, wind blowing at us. That was the scariest part and that was hard at some points yeah. to get by. But it is well worth it. We actually haven't seen what the view is actually like when there's sunlight out, so we're excited to wake up in the morning. We're probably gonna get up at like 5 a.m. Yeah, so. I hope we can get some sleep with all this wind. All right, we'll see you guys bright and early in the morning. Guys, we just woke up, 5.30 in the morning. The light is finally coming out, so it's getting closer to six now. Much and less windy this morning. Yeah, so much better, it's so peaceful right now. And the sun has just started to come up over there. Surprisingly, we slept pretty well in a capsule on the side of a cliff. When I would start to forget where I was, you just look out the window and there's rocks covering half of the windows. It's a crazy idea, and it's crazy that we're here. You can open up the window and it opens into the side of the cliff here, and then this one just opens out into nothing. And it's just a straight drop down, 400 meters down. Glad we're still alive. <laughs> Look at this. So on this side, it's just cliff. Look at this window, totally transparent. 
you can see where you can climb down right here all cliff and it goes way up here the mountain and then here hold this for them to get this side and then here's the side with the view and we are over nothing right now we're not on a rock we're hanging by cables moment you've all been waiting for we're gonna give you a tour of this place so first we have queen-size bed really comfy mattress we have a window here that opens up <laughs> into the cliff this is where we're hanging so you can see up here outside this window we are hanging by cables. It looks like one, two, three, four, five, maybe six cables. There might be more than that. There probably are. But yeah, just hanging here. We have all these curtains for when it's light out or when you want some privacy. But you can just go like this, put it over here to see the stars or to see the view around you. We have windows on all sides. And I showed you already when you go out here what it looks like. So yeah, that's our bed. Amazing view right here of this river and the whole canyon on the way to Oyentaytambo. Uh, okay, next we have two beds right here. So if you're a group of friends or a family, you can have a couple people. You get up with the stool right here. And then this, this is how you get out this ladder and then you have a hatch up here oh. wow but we're not going out quite yet because Lindsay's gonna give you a bathroom tour we have a shelf that has some mugs that you can use for tea we have wine he brought us this hot thermos last night and then we have the shelf here this is where you put all your gear you can't leave the capsule without it Okay, now for the good part, the bathroom tour. Welcome in. Bathroom with the best view. Look at this. He's making our breakfast, you can see in that dome. See him in there. Gourmet breakfast coming up. So they don't actually have a system where it flushes. It's a dry system. So for boys, they pee in here. Girls pee in here, and then you empty it in here. Then you spray with a little alcohol, sanitization, and you're done. Now for when you have to go number two. Lift this lid up, take this out. There are some garbage bags. You just go ahead, open this up. Go like that. And put it back down. And you go in this bag. Then you tie it up and you throw it down that chute and it goes into some sort of bin where they keep the waste it doesn't go off into the cliff don't worry wow i've never had a toilet like that before pretty interesting they have some purified water there that you can use to wash your hands you can drink out of there 
All right, and on that note, this concludes the tour of our adventure suites on the cliff. We're gonna go get breakfast. We'll see you there. Here we go, we're gonna get a few views and then breakfast. Okay, haven't been outside yet. Let's see what it's like out here. Wow, to leave your room, you have to set these up right here. Safety first. Ooh, amazing. Now we just close up the hatch again. Okay, we're at the top of the capsule. There's this deck platform. So, this is what we slept on last night, guys. We are hanging from a thread. These, it's only these, <laughs> keeping us up on the side of the cliff here. Look at that cliff. <sighs> and then you can see, you can see our room down there. Look at that, there's our bed, completely transparent. <sighs> Look at that view. That's our room. I can't believe we slept in that last night. That is our house. Look at this. Ooh. Just sitting on the side of a cliff. Lindsay is in our room. Say hi. Look at that. Wow. Now let's go down there for breakfast. Bye bye, Adventure Suites. This went by way too fast. And sad at Tilford. One of the best experiences ever. <sighs> Breakfast is uh -huh. ready. Uh oh. All right, we just got back into the restaurant area for breakfast and it's all set up already. So we have like a fruit, what is it, like a fruit salad. You can put granola with it, so fruit and granola, ham and cheese, jam, honey, orange juice. We have some coffee, some creamer or some kind of milk for our coffee, yogurt, sugar, tea. Look at our view, we couldn't show you last night from the restaurant. our pod so this is where your bathroom stuff goes into there's the bathroom okay we've been climbing for a good 10 minutes not too far and now we've made it to the zip line to get down one of the I think six zip lines we'll go Lindsay getting ready this is my first time zip lining Lindsay's gonna do the longest zip line. 700 now. meters, here we go. We made it! Yeah! Want to go? Wow, that was awesome. That's probably the longest zip line I've ever done. So this is definitely a much more fun way to go down the hill, zip lining. 
We've done like five zip lines and we have, I think, we have one more left. So I don't know how many we've done. We've gone down this whole mountain. You can barely even see Sky Lodge anymore. That's it, we're done. <laughs> the end of Sky Lodge Adventure Suites. Take off this gear. Fun while it lasted. That was an experience that we will never forget. That was a bucket list item for me for so long, many years. And I was wondering if it would be everything that I was expecting. And it was, and more. That and more, yeah. Yeah, so very worth it. It's a bit expensive, but it's worth it. It's gonna be something you will never forget. It's $500 per person per night. So, expensive, but worth it. <laughs> Maybe they'll have some discounts at some point. We'll mm -hmm. see. How should I start it? <laughs> I don't know, I thought you knew what to say. It's um, Apu Lodge. Oh wait, do that again. Link below. It's Apu. Apu Lodge. No, we gotta go, we gotta So most of the way you have these, uh, what are the iron? Bars. Oh. <sighs> <coughs> All right, that concludes this tour. This place isn't that big, but it is. All right, that concludes the end of this, wait, no. <laughs> How do you get it to stay open? <laughs> you gotta have a bigger arm. <laughs> and I wasn't sure if it would be everything that I've been expected, but it was, it was. That has been at least Hey guys, we can only do so much on YouTube and we only put out a video every two or three days. So if you want more, if you want daily stuff, you should head to Instagram, find us at Alexander Travel Bum, and that's where you'll find daily stories and photos about our travels. Hey, thanks for making it all the way through this video. If you want to watch more, click one of these videos. Subscribe because I'm traveling all around the world and I'm sharing the whole thing with you. Thanks.